For the actor, see Ernst Schroeder. Friedrich Wilhelm Karl Ernst Schroeder was a German mathematician mainly known for his work on algebraic logic. He is a major figure in the history of mathematical logic, by virtue of summarizing and extending the work of George Boole, Augustus de Morgan, Hugh McCool, and especially Charles Pierce. He is best known for his monumental Volsung and Nuba die Algebra der Logik, in three volumes, which prepared the way for the emergence of mathematical logic as a separate discipline in the 20th century by systematizing the various systems of formal logic of the day, life. Schroeder learned mathematics at Heidelberg, Königsberg, and Zurich, under Otto Hess, Gustav Kirchhoff, and Franz Neumann. After teaching school for a few years, he moved to the Technische Hochschule Darmstadt in 1874. Two years later, he took up a chair in mathematics at the Polytechnische Schule in Karlsruhe, where he spent the remainder of his life. He never married. Work. Schroeder's early work on formal algebra and logic was written in ignorance of the British logicians George Ball and Augustus de Morgan. Instead, his sources were texts by Ohm, Hankel, Hermann Grassmann, and Robert Grassmann. In 1873, Schroeder learned of Buell's and de Morgan's work on logic. To their work he subsequently added several important concepts due to Charles Sanders Peirce, including subsumption and quantification. Schroeder also made original contributions to algebra, set theory, lattice theory, ordered sets and ordinal numbers. Along with Georg Cantor, he co-discovered the Cantor-Bernstein-Schroeder theorem, although Schroeder's proof is flawed. Felix Bernstein subsequently corrected the proof as part of his Ph.D. dissertation. Schroeder was a concise exposition of Boole's ideas on algebra and logic, which did much to introduce Boole's work to continental readers. The influence of the Grassmanns, especially Robert's little-known foreman Lehrer, is clear. Unlike Boole, Schroeder fully appreciated duality. John Venn and Christine Loud Franklin both warmly cited this short book of Schroeder's, and Charles Sanders Peirce used it as a text while teaching at Johns Hopkins University. Schroeder's masterwork, his Volsung and Uber die Algebra der Logik, was published in three volumes between 1890 and 1905, at the author's expense. Volume 2 is in two parts, the second published posthumously, edited by Eugen Muller. The Volsungen was a comprehensive and scholarly survey of algebraic logic up to the end of the 19th century one that had a considerable influence on the emergence of mathematical logic in the 20th century. The Volsungen is a prolix affair, only a small part of which has been translated into English. That part, along with an extended discussion of the entire Volsungen, is in Brady. Also see Grattan Guinness. Schroeder said his aim was influence. Schroeder's influence on the early development of the predicate calculus, mainly by popularizing C. S. Pierce's work on quantification, is at least as great as that of Frege or Pino. For an example of the influence of Schroeder's work on English-speaking logicians of the early 20th century, see Clarence Serving Louis. The relational concepts that pervade Principia Mathematica are very much owed to the Volsungen. Cited in Principia's preface and in Bertrand Russell's Principles of Mathematics, Frege dismissed Schroeder's work, and admiration for Frege's pioneering role has dominated subsequent historical discussion. Contrasting Frege with Schroeder and C.S. Pierce, however, Hilary Putnam writes, 